evening and welcome to our service of Compline for Friday the 26th of June. The Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Amen. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord, who made, made heaven, heaven and, and earth. earth. And we reflect on this past day. Most, Most merciful, merciful God, God, we, we confess, confess to you before, before the whole company of heaven and one another, another that we have sinned in thought, word and deed, and in what we have failed to do. Forgive us our sins, heal us by your Spirit, and raise us to new life in Christ. Amen. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. Alleluia. Before the ending of the day, Creator of the world, we pray that you with steadfast love would keep your watch around us while we sleep. From evil dreams defend our sight, from fears and terrors of the night. Tread underfoot our deadly foe, that we no sinful thoughts may know. O Father, that we ask be done, through Jesus Christ, your only Son, and Holy Spirit, by whose breath our souls are raised to life from death. Part of Psalm 139 O Lord, you have searched me out and known me. You know my sitting down and my rising up. You discern my thoughts from afar. You mark out my journeys and my resting place, and are acquainted with all my ways. For there is not a word on my tongue, but you, O Lord, know it altogether. You encompass me behind and before, and lay your hand upon me. Such knowledge is too wonderful for me, so high that I cannot attain it. Where can I go then from your spirit? Or where can I flee from your presence? If I climb up to heaven, you are there. If I make the grave my bed, you are there also. If I take the wings of the morning and dwell in the uttermost parts of the sea, even there your hand shall lead me, your right hand hold me fast. If I say, surely the darkness will cover me and the light around me turn to night. Even darkness is no darkness with you. The night is as clear as the day. Darkness and light to you are both alike. For you yourself created my inmost parts. You knit me together in my mother's womb. I thank you for I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Marvellous are your works, my soul knows well. My frame was not hidden from you when I was made in secret and woven in the depths of the earth. Your eyes beheld my form as yet unfinished. Already in your book were all my members written. As day by day they were fashioned, when as yet there was none of them. How deep are your counsels to me, O God! How great is the sum of them! If I count them, they are more in number than the sand, and at the end I am still in your presence. Glory to the Father, and, and to, to the, the Son, and, and to, to the, the Holy Spirit. Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be for ever. Amen. God has destined us not for wrath, but for obtaining salvation, through our Lord Jesus Christ, who died for us, so that whether we are awake or asleep, we may live with him. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. 
you have redeemed me, Lord God of truth. I, I commend, commend my, my spirit. spirit. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Into, Into your, your hands, hands O Lord, Lord, I commend my, my spirit. spirit. Keep me as the apple of your eye. Hide, Hide me, me under, under the shadow, shadow of your wings. Save us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep may rest in peace. Now, Lord, you let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation that you have prepared in the sight of every people, a light to reveal you to the nations and the glory of your people Israel. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be for ever. Amen. Save us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep may rest in peace. In faith and hope we pray to our Lord who has overcome death and reigns in glory. Let us pray. Light of the world, illumine the hearts and minds of our leaders. May they be guided by your wisdom, that their policies and decisions may keep us safe and well. Lord, hear us. Lord, Lord graciously, graciously hear us. Lord of life, we thank you for health service and carers, nurses and doctors. Equip them and protect them. Uphold them and sustain them. Encourage and surround them with your love. Lord, hear us. Lord, Lord graciously, graciously hear us. Lord of all hope, we pray for those in darkness and despair those who are anxious and fearful. Assure them of your presence and grant them peace of mind and heart. Lord, hear us. Lord, Lord graciously, graciously hear us. Lord of healing, we pray for the sick and unwell, for those in isolation and denied family access. Restore them to health and bring an end to their suffering. Reunite them with their families and protect from all harm. Lord, hear us. Lord, Lord graciously Jesus. hear us. Lord of all comfort, we pray for the dying and those who are grieving. Draw near and speak your words of eternal life. In your compassion, walk alongside and assure them of your loving presence. Lord, hear us. Lord, Lord graciously, graciously hear us. Lord of grace, we pray for our community. Pour out upon us your spirit of unity and loving concern, that we may care for one another and be sheltered under your wings. Lord, hear us. Lord, Lord graciously, graciously hear us. And on this Ember Day, we pray for all those who will be commissioned as lay ministers next Thursday and will be deaconed in our diocese later on in October. We pray for them, their ministries and the parishes in which they will serve. Lord, hear us. Lord, Lord graciously, graciously hear us. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of the living God, who, who at this evening hour lay in the tomb and hallowed the grave to be a bed of hope for all who put their trust in you. Give us such sorrow for our sins, which were the cause of your passion, that when our bodies lay in the dust, our souls may live with you forever. We commend ourselves and all for whom we pray to the mercy and protection of God with the prayer our Saviour taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, 
on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory, for ever and ever. Amen. In peace we will lie down and sleep. For you alone, Lord, make us dwell in safety. Abide with us, Lord Jesus, for the night is at hand and the day is now past. As the night watch looks for the morning, so, so do we, we look, look for you, O Christ. Christ. The Lord bless us and watch over us. The Lord make his face to shine upon us and be gracious to us. The Lord look kindly upon us and give us peace. Amen. Amen. just hope that you are able to get a good night's sleep tonight and we look forward to the cool refreshing rain tomorrow. Good night everybody. <laughs>